The Grand Cherokee was a big step forward for Jeep, and now it's the turn of its smaller brother, the Cherokee. We're in California to find out what it's like to drive. There's plenty of dramatic change for the fourth generation Cherokee, as it aims for a bigger slice of the world's biggest SUV market. On the outside, gone is the boxy styling of old, and in its place, a daring new look characterized by a bent version of the company's trademark seven slot grille. And underneath, the new Cherokee adopts independent suspension and a car-like monocoque body. The result is an SUV that is better to drive on the road than your average Jeep. There's a soothingly cushioned ride, the steering is accurate, and the Cherokee handles predictably, without suggesting it can match the nimbleness of a Mazda CX-5 or Ford Cougar. A two-litre diesel will be one of three engines offered in Australia, though only the two petrol offerings were available to test in the US. Neither the four-cylinder nor V6 provide effortless acceleration on winding roads or up hills, though progress feels easier on freeways and suburban streets. A new nine-speed automatic also contributes to significantly improved fuel consumption, though its gear changes weren't as responsive as expected. The 4x4 models that dominate the Jeep Cherokee range feature a four-wheel drive system that's front drive when cruising around to help fuel use, but can engage a prop shaft to send up to 100% torque to the rear wheels where needed. A select terrain system also allows the driver to tailor the vehicle settings for an assortment of surfaces, and the auto features low-range gearing for extra crawling ability. And if you are really serious about your off-roading, well, there is a Cherokee for you, and it's called the Trailhawk. As you can see, it's going to be pretty capable. The Trailhawk is the only Cherokee to get Jeep's trail rated badge of honour. That's thanks to additions including rear diff lock, reprofiled overhangs, a higher ride height, and dirt biased tyres. It certainly didn't have trouble coping with a range of off road challenges that included narrow rocky passages and steep sandy climbs and descents. The Cherokee's cabin offers ample comfort, whether you're on or off the beaten track. Storage options are also plentiful, there's an excellent infotainment touchscreen, and wavy trim curves said to be inspired by the raised wings of an American Eagle are a nice design touch. The previous Jeep Cherokee was a bit forgettable, but our first impressions overseas suggest the latest version will be worth remembering for your test drive list if you're in the market for a mid-sized SUV.